Hey, this is Brett, and this 2016 Dodge Challenger Hellcat is stock number 13887Z. I'm here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Dodge Challenger and sports car headquarters. This 2016 Dodge Challenger Hellcat has the 6.2 liter supercharged V8 engine. It puts out 707 horsepower when paired with the red key. This one has the automatic transmission. This car has been fully safetyed and inspected by our service shop per the state of Wisconsin inspection process. It has a fresh oil and, oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and this car is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, start it up, take a look under the hood and give you the most accurate representation that I can of the car. B5 Blue Metallic is the color. Shoot all my videos in 4K and if you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash summit auto. Click the bell notifications. You'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube. This one comes with the 20 inch brass monkey wheels. They are in fantastic condition. Of course, you get the Brembo brakes on there with the slotted rotors. This one comes with Firestone Firehawk Indy 500 tires. They're 275 40. R20s. I would say they have probably about 60 to 70 percent of the tread left in the front here. Front fender is in really nice condition. This one does have a 3M or a, a plastic wrap on the front of it. Um, so that goes to the end of the fender there and it's also wrapped on the front bumper. That front bumper and lower valence are in really nice shape. I didn't see any drill holes in the front bumper. I didn't see any major scuffs or scrapes on there either. Get the halo running lights, the HID headlamps. We'll turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see how nice and bright they are. And uh, this one comes with the black hood. You get the cowl induction in the middle and then the two heat extractors on the outside. My favorite looking hood on the Challengers. As you go down this side of the car, front fender looks really good. Didn't see any dents or dings and this passenger side front wheel no major scuffs or scrapes. B5 Blue Metallic, really rare to see these Hellcats in this color. Do not see too many of them. In fact, this might be one of my first ones I've ever videoed. Um, as you go down this side of the car though, see just how nice that body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. But I do really like the uh, B5 Blue. It's got a lot of metal flake to it. And I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down but you're still interested in purchasing the car, you can see the car, hear the car, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you. Back wheel's in excellent shape and the back tires have just as much tread as those front tires. Frame and underbody is in a really nice clean condition from what you can see. Coming around the back of the vehicle, rear bumper is in great shape. It does have the backup parking sensors, the uh, dual rear exhaust. Rear bumper is in fantastic condition. You get the LED tail lamps and the low gloss black spoiler. Back trunk area is in very nice clean condition and those shocks are doing a nice job holding that hood up. You get the Harman Kardon factory subwoofers, the tire inflator kit, and that's where your battery is located as well. Shuts nice and solidly. That trunk lid is in great shape. And going down the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, I didn't see any major dents or dings. Looks really good. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is in great shape as well. Down the rest of the side of the car, the doors, or the door looks good, has the heated power mirrors, blind spot monitoring. They have that wrap on the mirror as well. Entering go system. Inside the uh, Hellcat package gives you the black leather and Alcantara suede. Get the SRT stitched into the backrest. No rips or tears on the seats. Power driver's seat with lumbar, factory SRT floor mats, bright pedals, auto headlamps, power telescopic 
and tilt steering wheel. Harman Kardon sound, of course, power windows, locks, mirrors. You get the suede inserts on the doors, and you get the Hellcat logo underneath the door, which looks really good. Back seats are just as clean as the front seats. You get the red seat belts as well. Latch child safety system if you want to try and get a car seat back there. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this car has to offer on the interior. See that this one has 26,518 miles. I honestly can't believe it's that many miles. This car is really clean for those miles. A digital speedometer on that seven inch LCD display. Instrument cluster is very nice and clean. Comes with the leather wrap steering wheel. Cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. You do get the paddle shifters on the back of the steering wheel and the audio controls on the back of the steering wheel as well. This one has the 8.4 3C radio. Note that you get the machine finished dash and center console trim on here. Um, you have all your more tactile volume tune and climate controls down here, including launch control, SRT, and stability control. Uh, your radio here, you get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You also get your heated and cooled seat buttons, as well as your heated steering wheel controls. Get all your different apps on here, including the performance pages, and they do take a second to load sometimes. There is your factory navigation system. There's Highway 41, so that is working nicely. You always want to make sure that these nav systems are working on these radios, especially in the Challengers. Um, they have been known to fail, uh, but this one's working great. And then you get your performance pages. They do take a second to load as well. In fact, it's loading right now. It has the keyless entry with remote start, and that's a nice shape. Your 8-speed automatic transmission and the passenger side floor mat and seat are in fantastic condition as well. I don't think this car's ever been smoked in. It smells very clean inside. And the headliner is in great shape. It does have the power sunroof. Map lights, home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems, sunroof controls, and 911 and assist buttons in the mirror. Here are your performance pages. Uh, you have your timers, your gauges. I'll show you the gauges first. So you get all those, your G-Force, and then you also get your engine, what it's doing. And of course, it's off right now, so it's not going to be doing anything. Then your timers, they do take a second to load. Um, and while they're loading, I'm going to start the car up. And uh, then we'll listen to that exhaust and check out the lights. And we'll also take a look under the hood. Oh, there are your um, timers right there. All right, let's start it up. Starts right up. No check engine lights or anything like that. We will be putting some fuel in this car right after this video. Love those LED tail lamps. Really like the sound of the Hellcats. They uh, sound really good. You can actually feel the air pumping on those Hellcats. It's pretty crazy. There are those HID headlamps, the LED running lights. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality condition options and of course, cleanliness of this car all the way around inside. Now under the hood, we have an extremely clean engine bay. Engine runs really smooth. Once again, this car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and it is 100% ready to go. There is the emissions sticker. Shocks are doing a nice job holding that hood up. And I would highly recommend this car from a quality and condition standpoint. I would ship this one anywhere, California, Texas, New York, Florida. Whoever's gonna get this car is gonna be very happy with the quality and condition on it, especially for the miles on the car. And to see more pictures of this car, one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, Challengers, Chargers, Mustangs, Corvettes, Camaros, Z06s, Hellcats, GT500s, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, summitauto.com. 
full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications. You'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and sports car walkarounds on YouTube. 8,000 videos and counting. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left. A link to more Challenger videos that I've done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2016 Dodge Challenger Hellcat in B5 Blue Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.